my mother used to say, this is about 70 years old saying, she used to tell us children that you must live like a saint, you must think like a scholar, and you must act like a warrior. What does it mean? You know, this is a woman, this is a woman who had studied only up to eighth class. She was not a scholar, nothing. Only eighth class. The, the only English she could write was, she could sign in English. That's it. Beyond that, nothing. But that, that was a very important uh, uh, lesson that was ingrained into all of us. Now, therefore, if all the entrepreneurs assembled here were to remember that, that is, live like a saint, think like a scholar, and act like a warrior. What that means is, when you are building your company, please embrace frugality. Please embrace, you know, austerity. Have a big vision, but big vision should be in targets. Big vision should be in achievement, not in spending. Second, Think like a scholar. Think about your idea very deeply, very carefully before you start pitching it. Make sure that your idea has a differentiated business value to the customer or differentiated value to a consumer compared to all other existing ideas. For that, you, they need to think like scholars. They need to go deep into it. They need to conduct some market research. They need to understand the market well. And finally, as my mother said, act like a warrior. The beauty of a warrior is, when you are in the trench out there at the border, you have very little comfort. It is very painful. It is very dangerous. You don't know whether you will exist tomorrow or not. But you have to be daring. You have to think of unusual methods of survival and success. So therefore, my friends, if there is one message that I can give you people is every entrepreneur must Live like a saint, think like a scholar, and act like a warrior. That's what I would say.